Hey guys, welcome back. It's me again, Damien BKM, Budak Kacamata. Back again for another review for today on the new product by H Cigar. The new H Cigar 4D24. Alright. So let's do a close up review video on it. And I'm giving my thoughts and opinion about how the H Cigar 4D24 is. Alright. Let's go, guys. Hey guys, so we take a close up look on the new H Cigar 4D24 by. H cigar obviously so it's a RDA taste RBA function 810 drip tip 316 SS material double row small inlet airflow and it's made in China and it's by a company called H cigar once again I mentioned H cigar all right so we're gonna open this up and take a look at what's inside the box very nice shiny logo here aha uh -huh. and a shiny color as well Okay, the one that I have here is the stainless steel version. There's also the black and the rainbow as well, which is available at Vape Empire outlets. So as you can see here, huge drip tip. Okay, so it's a 24 millimeter designed by H Cigar 4024. And as you can see, as most as how all the RDTAs, the tanks to the bottom, cars on the top. Okay, and you have here the airflow. Adjustable airflow actually. Let's just twist it around. So you can see as it closes in, open up, open one row. Alright. I like the designs though. Very sleeky kind of design. Alright. Oh, I forgot. Let's take a look at what's inside the box first. You have an extra Pyrex. Yeah. You have the manual in Chinese, but have no fear. They have in English too. <laughs> okay, so you can see here. Alright. So let's put this aside. You have a piece of the organic cotton. The extra O-rings. The ready-made coil. And Allen key as well. Alright, so that's what's inside the box. Keep everything back inside. Nice and neatly done. Yeah. Okay. So back to the mod. Sorry, back to the 40 24. Okay. Let's open this up. Yeah. Velocity deck. If you guys remember from the 4D uh, V2, it comes to the velocity deck as well. Those days, a lot of people were complaining about the H Sega 4D V2 and V1 because of its to refill the juices on the side here. There's a small little hole for you to fill in the juice. So now, I believe you won't have that problem anymore because what they did on how to refill the juice now. It is amazing. How do I fill my juice? These holes? Nope. Close this back. Let me give you a little twist here. Voila. So that is how big. Sorry. Uh, let's see. Clearly that. Uh huh. Yep, pouring straight directly in, directly in straight here. Okay, so if you have like a nozzle like this, easy peasy. All right, so let me just unscrew this out because I have one which is I've already made it. And where is it? Ah, there it is. I'm going to screw it on top of my VT200. Alright. As 
can see the coil I'm using there is like a mini juggernaut coil. Right? So the cotton. Right, so I'm just gonna put this in. Now for the cotton, you don't really have to like, you know, really put it down to the base. Okay, it's left hanging. Neatly tidy up there. Right, we're gonna pour the juice. Oh, excess. All right, put this up. Yeah, so I'm um, flavor I'm using today is actually the zombie mango high VG. They also came out with um, watermelon and grape as well. Fill it right through in. Let's look at it, how easy it is. Alright, place my deck on. Alright. Let's prime up the cotton. Oy, oy, oy. Ay, ay, ay. My bad, my bad. Right. Close it up. Uh, o rings a bit tight. Okay. Ready to set and rock and roll with the 4 v 2 So I'm going to take a vape on it right now and I'll share with you my thoughts and opinion on how the 4D24 is. Alright. See you later, guys. Hey guys, welcome back. So that was the Hey Cigar 4D24. As you can see here. Alright, so that's the RDTA. You can see there. Alright, um, a big shout out to Mr. Big P, Peter Vixnan for the coil, the mini juggernaut. It's really good. It's really, really good. So, we're not talking about the coil. We'll talk about the tank. We'll talk about the RDTA to be exact. What do I think about it? Let's take a vape. Okay, here's what I think about it. Despite its, you know, kind of restricted airflow, not too big, has a lot of mini holes here that you can adjust from the top here. It is fantastic. It is fantastic. Not too much of air, just nice. Yeah, flavoring is fantastic on it. Uh, it might not be that too commercialized like the Merlin RDTA, but you should try and get this out. This is really, really good. Okay. Let's talk about the cons of it. Number one, it doesn't have an interchangeable drip tip, so you can't change to your 510 drip tip. Number two, that I didn't really, you know, fancy about it is the bottom uh, 510 pin. You can't really adjust it, so it's gonna just stay. I'm just gonna show you guys, because I forgot to show you just now during the close up video. Oopsie. See? It is just that. Okay. I like mine to be you not know, adjustable so I can fit into any of my mods which is like you know probably the, the connector has went down okay but besides that truly honestly it's a great flavoring RDA vapor production is there fantastically done so yeah do go and check it out right now at Vape Empire Outlets the H Sega 4D24 Okay. And I'm very, very sure that staff around at the nearby Vape Empire to you will be more than happy to assist you on the new HCG 4D24. Alright, so I'm going to sign my way off right now with more of a review coming up very soon. I'm so sorry for a bit of delay. Do follow me on my Instagram, it's at DamienBKM, or you can check it out on my Facebook, which is Official Vape Empire Review. Alright.
Alright, till the next time guys, I'm gonna see you guys around. Same channel, same place, right here at Vip Empire. Till the next review guys, it's me Damien BKM. Uh-huh. Got my cap covered that I did this time. Alright, till the next review guys. It's me Damien BKM signing off. Peace out. Start smoking, start vaping. Vaping is the future. See you later guys.